school is going to sell without us. Oh no! Now I can't eat the wizard treats and sing about it! Look, oh, guys, stop whining. School ain't gonna start until I tell it. Do you want to know why? Um, why, little lady? I don't know, Rob. I already said it. I'm so rad. I'm like E.T. the extraterrestrial, except sexier. <laughs> Turn on the radio, Hermione. <clears throat> oh my god, I love this song. It's about me. Yes. All right. My name is Harry Potter. I'm the king of the car. Flying with my two best friends in a car. I beat up somebody and I stole the car. <laughs>
I wish the rest of you would turn to soot. <laughs> What? Again with these irrelevant memories? Blah! Get out! Be gone! Shoo! As if awkward teenage will they, won't they drama even compares to the heinous nightmare imagery I face every day. Horror and mayhem. Dungeons and dragons. Hall and oats, no. Stuff that would literally give you the spooks, the actual spooks. Like one time, I had to fight a warlock who was vomiting snakes into a cauldron of beating hearts. And once, I saw a unicorn getting murdered to death by two other unicorns. And another time, oh, this was bad, I saw a bunch of death eaters taking their dump on a handicapped parking spot. And, and one time, I touched a cursed gemstone, and it turned my hands into screaming baby versions of rock. And another time, I saw a volcano erupting out a wave of human skulls over a major Canadian city. But none of those compare to the fear I felt the last time I really hung out with Dumbledore. Where are we going? Into a cave of pure evil. <laughs> Bet you wish you wore flip-flops now, eh? Whatever, I'm hungry. Can you magic me a sandwich? Sadly not. I thought you were a great wizard or something. We have a mission, Harry. A very special locket resides in this cave. We must get it. You brought me here for jewelry? I don't get this adventure, Dumbledore. Listen, Harry. Voldemort has set up the Easter egg hunt from hell. And the prizes are chunks of his soul. They're called soul chunks. I mean horcruxes. They're of the utmost importance. If we can destroy all seven of Voldemort's special soul chunks, he'll get really embarrassed and leave us alone forever. Oh, I get it. So the cave is a horcrux. No, the locket is. Oh, okay, good. Oh dear. This is dark magic. What's in it? At the bottom lies the Horcrux. Listen, Harry, in order to break this hex and get the Horcrux, I'm afraid I'm going to have to bob for apples. No matter what I say, don't let me stop. Even if I beg you to kill me, I must keep bobbing until my decrepit old body is filled to the brim with shiny red apples. Do you understand, Harry? Got it. Okay, here I go. You keep doing that, Dumbledore. I'm gonna check my Gmail. Well, that wasn't so hard. Oh, cool. Where's the locket? Alas, pretty sure I swallowed it. Should turn up in the next few days. That's nasty. Now we must leave, Harry, and quickly, before. It's the Inferi! Oh, shit! What are Inferi? Are you really asking me questions now, Harry? Let's book it! Oh no, we can't! They've got us! Use your magic, Harry! I don't know any spells to fight this! The spell of love! Love? What's love got to do with it? Who needs a heart when a heart can be broken? Fight the darkness with positivity! Think about people you love, Harry! Okay, um, I'm thinking about Ginny, and I'm also thinking about Vin Diesel, but I'm not sure why. Okay. And now Vin Diesel's making out with Ginny, and I'm watching, and I'm strangely okay with it. It's working, Harry. Wow. I can't believe that worked. Of course it worked. What have I always told you? Um, something about, uh, socks? No! Listen to me, Harry! I didn't know 
know there was a gym at Hogwarts. <laughs> oh yeah, membership paid too bad. 